<clears throat> Are we live? Yes, indeed. This is Frank Monday coming out to your brother, Freighter Francis, with the Lock Drive, Jive Archive on June 11th, 2021. So, not a lot going on in the city today. Uh, I got out sufficiently early this morning so that traffic was not a nuisance but it's starting to pile in now I'm driving super chill today it's Friday I enjoy Fridays as much as I enjoy Mondays Fridays you look forward to the weekend Mondays you look forward to the work week I've thought a lot about getting my swing dancing racket going again uh, soon I'd like to find another place to swing dance and have a swing class that's always fun uh, kung fu and dance are huge motivators for me for keeping me active and enjoying life meeting new people socializing I'm gonna violate the ban on socializing get back out there and swing your ass fun times would also like to get a mastermind group going again had one years back with uh, a friend Frater Tomas who has disappeared from <clears throat> the celest the kingdom of the celestial dragon and made his way down to Thailand. I do believe that's where he is these days. See if my camera doesn't look totally level. It's all right. Um I think there's only about a month left of school and then we're out for summer see we're in June so yeah the uh, first couple weeks of July seems like yeah maybe one month left middle of July I think school's out school's out for summer So who knows what's going to be going on with the world at that point. If old Willie Waits and Dr. Fakey are still trying to run their scam. Or if uh, Lou over at the CIA will uh, roll out the UFO threat narrative. They're always trying to run some sort of scam in the media and justify their hugely inflated budgets. It's like, well, yeah, we can't afford to give the poor any money, but we can sure as hell afford to give all of our croonies millions of dollars a year to run uh, social engineering programs against the health and stability of the average individual as if the average individual's life isn't hard enough how about some uh, some psyops about bat viruses what's going to be the next big shoe to drop I should give it some thought I haven't thought about haven't thought about that in a while because you just never know what they're going to get up to it seems like they just recycle the same old shit year in and year out but the UFO threat narrative is kind of a new thing the bat virus really wasn't new or unique or novel like they said it was but their approach their bold in your face 
uh, removal of human liberties, civil liberties, was a little bit novel, huh? I think that was the only thing novel about the uh, SARS 2.0 was letting everybody know that glo global governance is firmly in place. All right, so magic and martial arts, man, they go hand in hand. They go together like peaches and cream. They are two of the more refined arts in society. Magic gives you a good foundation for the practice of magic because magic by nature requires long hours of reading and concentration and attention to detail. And martial with martial arts as a foundation, you have a stronger physical body with which to project your energy from. You've got more energy. You learn to refine and cultivate that energy so you can be a greater conduit for it. And I don't just mean any old martial art because some of them make you very gross and aggressive. Gross meaning an excessive amount of stagnant energy. They make you grosser and less refined. And uh, yeah, it depends on the level of your practice in it too. Uh, Whereas some of the movement arts make your energy subtler. So take, for example, the internal arts of China, which include Xingyi, Bagua Zhang, Xingyi Quan, Bagua Zhang, Taiji Quan, Baji Quan, Wuji Quan, and uh, Yonghe Quan. Uh, those ones use the internal energy to to guide the movements and they refine a subtler level of energy. I'm a Xingyi Bagua practitioner. Not a lot of Taiji. I've learned some basic Taiji forms. I learned the basic Chen style, uh, short form, 24 movements, and the long form. But they didn't root as deeply as Xing Yi Quan, and I'll tell you why. I was always looking for a ambidextrous style of balancing both sides of the body equally, being able to blast from the left just as effectively from right or left. So most of the forms and sets focus on one side of the body more than the other. Chen style, Yang style, whatever you like, Wu style, they all have their sets which will do certain movements on the right side of the body but not on the left. And they'll use the left side of the body for a receiving a receptive type uh, thing and then the right side for delivery which is fine for combat but it's not great for just basic every single day training now Xing Yi on the other hand with its uh, original spear sets that are done in fist form and then the five elements and the twelve animals has a far superior, a far more balanced approach. When you explode on the right, or with the left fist, exploding on the right side of the body, then you'll explode on the left. Right fist, left side of the body. And uh, you'll cross back and forth with an equal amount. So for my day-to-day -day practice, it's for how long now? 
30 plus years of doing Xingyi. And Bagua, I like Bagua. Bagua also has that same value. It'll do the set on the left side of the body, and then you'll turn and do the set on the right side of the body. And so, in my humble opinion, this is far superior for training the mind and body. Getting the set done equally, mirror image on both sides of the body. Why, you ask? Master Gao Ke Li. Who knew? There's a, just told you my Chinese name there. Master Gao. Why are you talking about martial arts today on Friday? Because I want to show you a basic five element Qigong set later when I get to the dorm. And I thought I would preface this with the live drive jive and let you know that uh, I'd like to put together the, or just show you the basic five qigong postures for xing yi chuan xing yi is a uh, english translation is mind form boxing the original chinese it means intention boxing mind intent boxing or fist mind intention fist uh you can find it on wikipedia Back when I began studying, there weren't even home computers, let alone Wikipedia. But nowadays, those types of sites seem to be the authority on information of this type. So if you want to look it up, you, there's two systems of spelling. Uh, oh, I'll put it in the description. So it's X-I-N-G-Y-I for the mainland China spelling. And for other systems, it's H S I N G and then I Xing Yi Chuan. All right, we have arrived at Plum Blossom Lane. So north we go. I will cut this one here and see you back here in a moment for part three. Hugs and kisses into the abodes.